I'm here with Neil deGrasse Tyson, star of Cosmos, a space time odyssey. Host of Cosmos. We have real stars, okay? <laughs> Actual it. stars. Host. I'm not one of the stars. I'm the host. So, so tell me how involved you are in Cosmos, which is... Would you call it like a reboot of the Carl Sagan That's series? That term has been used, mm -hmm. but what we did was we looked to see what all the most awesome stuff was of the original appearance of the series back in 1980. The real things we're carrying forward is how we go about telling the stories of science. And that's what makes it different from any other attempt to bring science to television. There's a literal and figurative vehicle mm -hmm. for telling this story. The subtitle here is a space-time odyssey. How do you move around to where you gotta go? So I have a spaceship, actually. The ship responds to my thoughts. There's no buttons or anything. The bottom of the ship opens up and it is the past. And the ceiling opens up, it is the future. And then the panoramic windows is everywhere where we are. You want these messages, it's a message of science and our culture and our relationship to ourselves. People who are sure they don't like science will have access to it. And people who never knew they would like science would have access to it. And prime time on Fox, that's exactly where it's going, and that's exactly why. And after that, I'm just going to the Bahamas.